So I've been just getting this question a lot lately uh, since I've been getting a lot of, I guess, rated level uh, for the past week. The question is how the heck I get so many featured level in a short amount of time? Honestly, I have no idea. I never thought that Robtop would actually just look at my level and then just click those rate thingy button and then rate it my level. Uh, like one week and four rated level, one of them is an epic. It honestly blows my mind when I saw it. I actually have some reason why I get those so many featured level in a short amount of time. But this video is not about that. As you can see, I guess from the title of the video, you might be expecting, you know, joke video that people usually make on YouTube or for Geometry Dash. But this video is not a joke. This video is gonna be a full opinion about how do you get a featured or an epic level in Geometry Dash. Now, this is completely my opinion you probably have a different opinion or some people actually have different opinion but again this video is completely my opinion if you have your opinion let me know in the comments down below i guess let's start it with the first reason so the first technique that i actually have to get a feature or an epic level is to create a gameplay and a design level as you can see the from the first page featured there is a level called alkali named flatline now that level has such of amazing gameplay and such a good decoration and block design that it actually get the first page and the first place in featured level. Now if you see, I guess you can scroll on the featured list that is like Funke by Adial. That level has not that good, I guess, block design or like decoration. But that level have such an amazing gameplay and such a good moving object that it actually got epic. Another uh, example is Meo Dash by Abdullah. That level has really good design and really good gameplay. Now that's one reason, in my opinion, how to get featured. Just make a really, really good gameplay and really, really good design and block this level. So the second technique that I have in mind is make an effect level now there's a lot of effect level that is actually on the feature list now one example is b by monthly york that level has such a really really good effect not really effect you can say an art and such have amazing boss fight and just smooth moving object and then Robtop love those things and that's why that level have like over 200 thousand download and it's an epic rated now, one again, one of example is Quicken's new level, Traverse. That level has, I guess you can say, decent effects, but Robtop liked those things and then it got featured on the first page. So, if you cannot make good block design or good gameplay, make a really good effect level that have a really good, amazing background. Take inspiration again from, I guess, Sir Punch, Funny Game, uh, Quicken, or maybe some new creators like Multi York or even Jonathan GD. They have really good uh, background and effects that they have on their level. Just try to take some ideas from it and then make your own. Again, don't completely copy it, just make your own. So the third technique, and it's actually the most cheesiest technique in my opinion, is to be friend with a moderator. So Rob Top lately has been putting a lot of people into moderator and like there's pretty much like 50 moderator now in geometry dash the new one for example like partition some examples like wolf and gd lemons sir hadouken boy the cones ryan app and much more Robtop has been i guess making people moderator lately and you can get a higher chance that one of your famous friend is a moderator so what I'm trying to say is, if you have a decent or really good level that you just made, ask them to send it to Robtop, but ask them wisely. If you are one of those annoying people, <coughs> Tosh1021, you won't be able to do this technique. But you are, if you are like a nice person and the moderator that you talk is actually a nice person to you, you have a higher chance to get a feature and epic level because if you're friend with those mods, those mods gonna have a higher chance of sending your level and I guess it will get featured and epic. But one of the thing you have to do is your level have to be a good one. If your level is not a good one, 
don't ask them to send it to Rob Top. Make sure your level have to like a really good level. Ask other your other friends to like give your opinion about the level that you made. If they give like a positive opinion, you can ask a mod to actually send it. But if they still give you criticize or the level is not that good, just make a new one and then start with a new project that have a different design and then a different and then make it into a better level that you just made. You know, we have to learn from our mistake. So just keep going and you're probably gonna get featured in Epic. The fourth technique that you can use is to just create a shit ton of level. <laughs> you can see, you guys, you can take me as example. I make four level in around about one week and all of them are featured. <laughs> Lula, Fold, Friendship, and Emperors, all of them are featured in one week because maybe I am a fast builder. Another example is Ryan App. Ryan App is a really fast builder and he got a, pretty much a shit ton of CP from it. He almost has 18 CP and might get more from his newest level Rage Invasion. Now this technique might not work for some of you guys, but if you are a person that already have a CP, this might work for you. Robtop usually featured level that is faster, you know, a lot of new level that is actually good, he will feature them. But if you make a lot of level, but all of them are bad, you out of luck. You cannot actually get a featured level from that. You just have to get used to making good level in a short amount of time. Now the last reason, which is probably the most efficient reason or op uh, opinion that I can give to you to get a feature on an epic level is to just create and be patient. It takes time to get a rated level from Robtop. It took me over one year to be actually finally get a rated level, which is my first level in new life. Like I started playing GD in like the beginning of 2.0. And those 2.0 time, I didn't get any featured and I have created over 25 level. All of them are not featured until 2.1 when I actually found my design and I found my style. Robto finally noticed me and then it got featured. So what I'm saying is just be patient. It doesn't happen one night to get a featured level. You just have to keep creating. Just keep uploading level. You can rush level. You can make, you can put effort on that level, but just make it every single level that you upload is good. You know, like each level until like the top is just getting better and better and better. And then eventually, like some mod will notice you or like even Robtop will notice you and it will be rated. Getting featured at an epic level is not easy. It, it requires patience and requires practice to be able to get those. So yeah, that's some, I guess, opinion that I can give it to you to be able to get a featured level from Robtop. If you have your own opinion, let me know in the comments down below. I'd be love to see what you guys' opinion. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this new type of video where I just, you know, talks, not like play games or like have my face showed up and with like talk with cool animation in the screen, you know. <laughs> I actually want to give a special thanks or I guess a shout out to Krifo. Krifo actually inspired me to make this type of video. I don't really know that guy and that guy probably don't know me, but his content are amazing. So you should check his channel out in the description down below. He creates some amazing content that you're probably gonna enjoy. Before I end this video, I want you guys to let me know what should I talk about for the next video like this. So you can say any topic, you know, like how do you beat demons or how do you gain so much star or maybe how do you do effects. I'll be love to see what you guys wanted for my channel. Again, all of I do this just for you guys entertainment. I don't, I actually don't do this really for money. I don't really get any revenue too. So if you guys have any idea, Again, let me know in the comments down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video and I will see you all again next time. Say goodbye. Bye-bye.